angry Celine Dion ordered security to throw Harry out of the 2024 Upper Deck NHL Draft, uninvited. In an unexpected and dramatic turn of events, the renowned singer Celine Dion reportedly ordered security to eject Prince Harry from the 2024 NHL Draft held at the Sphere in Las Vegas on Friday, June the 28th. The 56-year-old music legend, known for a powerful voice and poised demeanour, was at the event to announce the Montreal Canadiens' fifth-round draft pick, but her actions towards Prince Harry have sparked widespread controversy and criticism. The NHL Draft, an annual event that garners significant attention from sports enthusiasts and celebrities alike, was in full swing when Celine Dion made her surprise appearance. She was introduced on stage as the Canadian's number one fan, a title she embraced with evident pride, wearing a stunning white v-neck dress and accompanied by her oldest son, René Charles Angelil. Dion's entrance was met with enthusiastic cheers from the crowd. As Dion made her way to the stage, smiling and greeting team heads with handshakes and cheek kisses, the atmosphere was electric. She approached the microphone with a mix of excitement and humour, even joking, I'm excited, I'm not even a hockey mum, before announcing the Canadian's draft pick, Ian Demida from Russia. However, the festive mood was abruptly interrupted by an unexpected commotion involving Prince Harry, who's been a frequent subject of media attention and public scrutiny. Attending the event without an official invitation, reports suggest that his unplanned appearance was motivated by his personal interest in hockey and his desire to engage with the sporting community. However, his presence didn't sit well with Celine Dion, who reportedly viewed it as an intrusion. Eyewitnesses recount that as Dion noticed Prince Harry mingling with the attendees, her demeanour changed noticeably. She was seen exchanging hurried words with the event's security team, after which security personnel approached Prince Harry and asked him to leave. The request quickly escalated into a scene that caught the attention of everyone present. The details of what transpired between Prince Harry and the security team remain somewhat unclear. However, it's widely reported that Harry was visibly taken aback by the demand to leave. Sources close to the prince indicate that he tried to explain his presence and reason with the security staff, but his efforts were all in vain. As the security team escorted Prince Harry out of the venue, the incident drew mixed reactions from the audience. Some attendees expressed shock and disapproval of Dion's actions, while others believed that she was justified in maintaining the event's decorum and exclusivity. The incident quickly became a hot topic on social media and news outlets, with many criticising Celine Dion for her apparent hostility towards Prince Harry. Critics argued that her actions were unbecoming of a public figure known for her grace and kindness, pointing out that Harry's presence, though uninvited, didn't warrant such a drastic response. Supporters of Prince Harry took to social media to express their outrage, with many calling Dion's behaviour disrespectful and unnecessary. They highlighted Harry's contributions to various charitable causes and his efforts to raise awareness about mental health issues, arguing that he deserved better treatment. In the wake of the backlash, representatives for Celine Dion issued a statement defending her actions. They emphasised that Dion's primary concern was the integrity of the event and the comfort of the invited guests. The statement noted that Dion was not informed about Prince Harry's attendance beforehand and felt it inappropriate for an uninvited guest even a high-profile one, to overshadow the event. Celine Dion has always been a dedicated supporter of the Montreal Canadiens in the NHL draft, the statement read. Her actions were solely motivated by a desire to ensure that the event proceeded smoothly and without disruptions. She respects Prince Harry and his contributions, but felt that his presence without prior arrangement wasn't in line with the event's protocols.